special homecoming edition of LMTV News. Linmar, your news starts now. Good morning, Linmar. It's World Smile Day, Friday, October 2nd, 2015. Here's a look at the stories making news on your Linmar campus. Our top story, the 2015 Homecoming King and Queen have been crowned. LMTV cameras were there at last night's coronation. Linmar 2015 Homecoming King is Kyle Waterman. Congratulations, Kyle and Jessica, and to all the members of the Homecoming Court. In other news, Homecoming Week is coming to a close, but the weekend is just beginning. Erica and Jeff are here with your Homecoming Weekend Report. Well, guys, this weekend is going to be a big one. We kick off our Homecoming Weekend at at our stadium against Kennedy. Sophomore game starts at 5 with varsity to follow. Remember, if you can't make it to the game, the live sports crew will be streaming it live. Just go to Ustream and search for LMTV Live Sports. Tomorrow, the Linmar Marching Lions will travel to Prairie for an invitational there. They will perform at 2 p.m. Also tomorrow is the long-awaited homecoming dance. It starts at 8 o'clock in the main gym. Remember to bring your school ID. We have three new movies to tell you about. The Martian. And ex after expeditioners get caught in a dust storm on the planet Mars, a man is presumed dead and is left stranded on the red planet. He is left alone to survive on limited supplies in the hope that he may be rescued. The Walk Based on the true story of a high-wire artist, The Walk tells the story of a man following his biggest dream, to walk between the World Trade Center towers. Free Held A police lieutenant and her wife battle for her pension after she is diagnosed with terminal cancer. That's your homecoming weekend. Make it a good one. Becky, back to you. Thanks, guys. Don't forget, there's a pep rally today at 255 in the main gym. Come and show your school spirit. We'll be back with more LMTV news right after this. LMTV Live Sports wants you. We are looking for new members to join our team, run some cool equipment, just like the pros, and have fun doing it. See Mr. Fi in the LMTV studio before school to find out more. LMTV Live Sports, we are Linmar. Welcome back. The homecoming dance is tomorrow night from 8 to 11 in the high school gym. Come in door 14. That's the south parking lot door with the double lions. Cost is $15 for couples and $10 for singles. You must bring your school ID. Read Photography will be here starting at 4 p.m. in the Ox Gym. Now Nathan is here with today's sports. Thanks, Becky. On the scoreboard, boys golf came in third out of four teams in Iowa City. Today in Linmar Sports, ninth grade football will host a game at 5 against Kennedy. In other sports news, there will be a wrestling sign-up meeting Tuesday morning at 8 in the food court. Any student interested in going out for wrestling or being a wrestling manager should attend this meeting. The boys' swim team needs people to record video of their swim meets. If you are interested, stop by the LMTV studios, room J201 before school or contact the athletic office. At Sports, Becky, back to you. Thanks, Nathan. In news from the counselors, anyone looking to earn some community service volunteer hours for your resume may work at the Scouting for Food event at Rockwell Collins this Saturday. See Mr. McCauley for more information. Math and foreign language tutors are needed. If you can help, stop by the counselor's office for an application. For more information on these stories, stop by your counselor's office or check out their blog or website. Now Jonah joins us with the Arts and Clubs. Thanks, Becky. On the Arts and Clubs scene, Key Club will meet Wednesday morning at 8 in the food court. Everyone is welcome. Attention all art students, it's time for the Scholastic Art Competition. Artwork should be finished and ready for display. Questions? Please see any of the art teachers as soon as possible. Attention all juniors, applications for prom committee are now available. Pick up an application outside of room L119 or in the 11-12 office. 
Return them to Mrs. Crandall by October 7th. Amplify your FFA experience by attending to the National FFA Convention in Louisville, Kentucky. Please turn in your applications and deposit by the end of the week to Ms. Lemmer. That's your club update. Becky, back to you. Thanks, Donna. Hey, Nathan, what's for lunch? Oh, it's Philly cheese steak with fajita veggies and steamed green beans. Or the deli sandwich bar. In the food court, it's beef and cheese gyro. That's lunch, Becky. Back to you. Thanks, Nathan. Now, weathercaster Garrett is here with this weekend's sports forecast. How's the weather looking for the weekend? Well, grab a jacket if you're going to the game tonight. We're only going to see a game time temperature about 50 degrees. Today, we're going to see a high of about 62 degrees with sunny skies. Saturday and Sunday is going to look sunny with a high of only 61. That's your weather forecast. Becky, back to you. Thanks, Garrett. And that wraps up today's edition of LMTV News. Remember, LMTV is always available online. Just follow. Just check out our high school website or follow us on Twitter. For the entire cast and crew, thanks for watching. Join us again on Monday and make a, a great weekend, Linmar.